is New Zealand taking on Fiji. We're underway in the first cup semi-final for 2013 here in Dubai. Heem goes up to challenge for New Zealand now looking to try and slow things down to be patient. Bringing in Curtis. Now there's Curry. Good clean out the ball is there. Available has been tapped forward. All he needs to do is control it, pick it up and Kunatani feeds inside for the first try of the game to Ratumbuli. Kalini Sal now with the start. Curry goes up, but there's been one by Kaka feeds. Now to Weber. Heem started in the forwards this morning, but now they've moved him into the backs, and that's a very good tackle coming in from Ratumbuli. It's gone free, and they've picked it up, and here comes Fiji, second try. Masi Levu couldn't believe it. Let's watch this try again. Look at this from the kickoff, the height on the kickoff. Fiji up, gather the ball. Sami Kunitani. Well, if they didn't have much self-belief before this game, that's all gone out the window. Been Kunitani. Can New Zealand get their hands on the ball? Up goes Mickelson, but he's lost it forward. Bye. Feed is good. Basic mistakes from New Zealand, and now the kick and chase. No sweeper in behind. It's a foot race. Who's going to win it? Oh, it's won by another Fiji, and then Colini Sal. Well, the knock on from Mickelson led to the scrum, and from the scrum they scored. On two other occasions, they've won it. And here goes Pio Tuwai. Oh, Pio Tuwai. He'll have too much pace and score a fifth. Wow. Nice to nil and had the break. Fiji lead by 29 to nil. So unbelievable. There are the Fijians. They've had their message from Ben Ryan, and I'd imagine it's the quickest chat he's ever had to make. The restart by Colin Isau, New Zealand. Five tries down, just looking for some possession, and finally it's going to go their way. Evades the first and then spins it out wide where Mickelson has the ball. Has a player out to his left who is Curtis. Ambrose Curtis stepping on the inside. Mickelson should have looped and has a lot of ball movement. Here comes Heeman. He's passed it back to a Fijian. Well, he looked back and he couldn't believe it. It's a foot race. Mulivaru. Too white. If they score here, it's shut the gate for Fiji. Mulivaru and they're going to score. That is Fijian rugby at its absolute best. <laughs> Are we loving this? I'm, I'm afraid that. From a New Zealand perspective, I know you must be looking at this in absolute awe. Well, cut breaks that have been made by Fiji. And those little errors from New Zealand passing to a Fiji and knocking it forward from the get-go as Curtis now flicks it out the back. And here comes try number seven. You can be up one day and then the next. You're staring down the barrel of a good old-fashioned hiding. Like him bull up. He wants to get involved in it. Heem is still on the field. Cuck up. Now it looked for the switch. Things just not sticking here as Mickelson now puts the accelerator down and gets that wide. That's gone forward. The 10 meters or not allowing for it. And now Fiji want to go on with it. Masilevu gets it wide. Here comes try number eight. Sangiwa. Any opposition. And now the Fijians are just playing the clock down by kicking it to where nobody is. And referee Ansami says, I've had enough. And 14 minutes, eight tries. And Fiji have thumped New Zealand 44-0. Wow, Ben, I, I, I'm speechless. What about you? Yeah, so am I a little bit. Um, but <laughs> I'm speechless as well.